Hey, what's up, people? This is Skip Ghost Harmon. Y'all know what it is. I am and will always be the most underrated, never duplicated, darkest, funniest sneaker YouTube in the game. Facts. Today's date is January 12th, 2020. Y'all read the title. Y'all know what it is. Y'all definitely see the thumbnail. Look, I was on my Instagram, Skip Goes Hard, and uh, I was making a live video interacting with the chat. And it seems like every time... I go live on Instagram, man. I always just come up with like real talk, like ideas or thoughts, real talk thoughts, always. And I thought of, I, I, I thought about how sneaker YouTubers, I can say, well, we sneaker YouTubers, how we'll make our top five or top ten pickups of the year. But we bought way more than five, way more than 10 sneakers throughout the year. So when you think about it, how come it's not like the top, like ranking the my top pickups of the year? You know what I mean? Like a sneaker YouTuber, if they bought like 22 shoes, 38 shoes, 14 shoes, 20 shoes, 19 shoes. Wouldn't it make sense for us to be like, okay, these are my top pickups ranking the shoes that I picked up this year. You know what I mean? But because when it comes down to it, and we know, sneaker YouTubers know, and our audience knows that sometimes we buy shoes just to pimp views. You know what I mean? Even I do. I buy shoes to pimp views. But I was really thinking about it. Like, a lot of sneaker YouTubers will damn near buy Every release that comes out, just, you know, to have some content, to pimp the views. But you then you don't hear nothing about that shoe ever again. You know what I mean? <clears throat> like, when you buy something, you want it. Or you really want it, correct? You know what I mean? Like, if you buy something, if you spend $200 on something, like a shoe, this would be a shoe that you would really want, right? So if you spent $200 or $100 or $150 on shoes throughout the year, and let's say you accumulate 20 shoes, when you do your pickups of that year, it should be, these are my pickups of this year, and I'm going to rank all 20 shoes that I bought. I mean, does, does that make sense? Like, are y'all following me? Because like I said, like, we or they, we buy they buy 16, 17 shoes a year, 25 shoes a year, but it only comes down to 10 shoes. So why did you buy those other shoes? You felt like the, all the, the shoes that are not on the list, they are not worthy. I mean, well, they weren't that worthy. I guess you really didn't care about them that much to even throw them in your video, which brings me to say this. 98% of sneaker YouTubers who bought those reverse he got games, whether on release day or early, I bet 98% of you all, them bitches are not going to be on your top 10 pickers of 2020. Mark my words. That means you bought that shoe either on the day of the release or early just to pimp views. Facts. Facts. Fuck you, man. Facts. 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 All I speak is a lot of facts. 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 Looking at. Facts. Woo! Facts. Facts. Mark my words. Now, I say 98% because the other 2%, <clears throat> that shoe was actually going to be in one of their top pickup videos of 2020. I know it. But 98% of sneaker YouTubers who bought those reverse he got games, whether they were early pickups or release day pickups, I bet that that damn shoe was not going to be on your top pickups of 2020. Mark my black ass words. Facts. And at the end of 2020, once, once everybody starts making their puss ass videos, I'm going to play this snippet. What I said about I bet the reverse he got games is not going to be 
on their list. This is one I want people to do. I'm well, actually, I don't. I'm not gonna say I'm gonna pay attention because I can give. I want you all to really pay attention to pickups that all sneaker YouTubers pick up, even myself. I mean, you don't have to do it. I'm just saying. And realize if they're just buying shoes just to buy them, just to pimp views, or is this going to be shoes that they really, really like? Watch how many shoes that sneaker YouTubers pick up. And damn, there half of those shoes are not even going to be on their list. That means they just bought the shoe just to pimp views, and they're either going to take it back to the store, or they're going to resell it, or they're just going to do something with it. It's going to be a, they're going to give it away to somebody we don't even know who they are, a family member or a friend or some shit like that. Watch. Y'all see, this is me just keeping it real, man. I just, I just, I just thought about it. And I, I don't know. And I don't want this to come off the scene like I'm hating on sneaking YouTubers. Because even though it, even if it does come off as me hating on sneaking YouTubers, I don't give up because none of them are going to want me. Facts. And I, I love saying that because it's facts. I love it. I love it. I love saying that because it's facts. Ain't nobody going to whip me. Facts. Uh, but look, that's it. Look, I'm Skip Goes Hard. I'm scratching the hell out of my head. I'm them dry ass. The shampoo I use, dry my damn hair out. Look at that. But, <laughs> man, y'all take care, man. This is a little real talk video. Nothing too special. And, hey, subscribe to the channel. Peace.